This is the Movie Channel, all movies 24 hours a day. The heart of Hollywood beats on with Woody Allen's manic comedy about love and politics and how to become the head of a Latin American country. Howard Cosell does commentary, Marvin Hamlish does music, and Sylvester Stallone does a bit part in Bananas, next on the Movie Channel. Gene Hackman. I didn't think you'd come. I, um, I'm glad you did, but I, I, I didn't think you would. Anne Margaret. I have been man proof for so long. Ellen Burstyn. I don't know what he wants. I tried to please him. I thought I was being everything he wanted me to be. Three people whose lives will never be the same again. Well, you can't let him walk all over you. Come on, you have to stand up for your rights. It's nice having a guy around again. I never denied him nothing. Never. I'm not just a guy in a bar, you know. I love you. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Prove it. I don't deserve what your father done to me. I don't deserve this. I've been hurt. Twice in a Lifetime premieres Saturday, April 25th on the Movie Channel. This weekend, the Movie Channel brings you different and exciting movies every night. On Friday, the mysteries continue as Who Done It Week presents Clue. The classic board game comes to life as Tim Curry of Rocky Horror Show joins Leslie Ann Warren, Martin Mull, and Madeline Kahn in solving the mystery of Clue. On Saturday, Charles Bronson is a cop accused of murdering his ex-wife. Now he's got to find the real killer, fast. Charles Bronson in Murphy's Law. On Sunday, he's just been fired from his job in advertising. She's just quit her job in personnel. They've sold everything they own. They're dropping out forever. Albert Brooks and Julie Haggerty are both lost in America. Then... They wondered what life was like beyond their own backyard. They had no idea what they'd find. They were explorers. For a weekend that's filled with exciting movies, the Movie Channel is the only place to be. They escape prison together. They battled the elements. They achieved the impossible. Now, man. But their train to freedom was out of control. I don't know what happened, but there's no engineer on this train. There's nobody on this train but us. Their strug for freedom became a fight for their lives. Nominated for three Academy Awards, including Best Actor and Best Supporting Actor. John Voight. Eric Roberts and Rebecca de Mornay star in one of the greatest escape stories ever told. I tell you, man, you guys suck on everything. Runaway Train on the Movie Channel. Saturday. Stay tuned for a classic film short on the Movie Channel, the heart of Hollywood. There must be a fire someplace. I wouldn't be a bit surprised. There's the rest of the firemen. They're upstairs sleeping. Sleeping? Who tells them to sleep? They don't ask anybody. They just sleep. By rights, I should be sleeping. I'm the chief. Mm. The way you snore, you sound like a whole fire department. 
What is the use of having fires if the firemen are going to sleep around here? Say, what is this? Happy New Year's? What are the bells all ringing here all day tonight long? What's the matter? Maybe it's your broker. Find out how General Motors is doing on the street for you. Hello? Yes, this is the fire... This is the firehouse, yes. What's that? Oh, is that so? Oh, that's too bad. Hold the wire, please. I'll, I'll find out. Wake up the boys and ask them if they feel like going to a fire. Boys, would you like to go to a fire? No! no. They're still sleeping. I'm awfully sorry. The boys are not in the humor. Call us up any other time. We'd be glad to help you out. What's that? Say, he said that's a small fire. Would you like to go or else? Or else what? Or else we wouldn't go. Tell them or else. Find out what street that fire is on, Chief. Say, buddy, what street is that fire on? What street is the fire located on? Canal Street. Why didn't you have that fire yesterday? We are on that street yesterday. I'm awfully sorry we can't go. Thank you very much for the invitation. Don't be a stranger. Let's hear from you again. I hope we don't lose his business. <laughs> That's, uh, that's my play. Let me see. Say, wait a minute. I had an ace here. Where's my ace? I took it with my king. You took my ace with the king? <laughs> it was a pleasure. You can't take an ace with the king. No. Certainly not. You can't take an ace with the king. Go ahead. Sue me. My house is on fire. My house is on fire. <laughs> Boys, give me 20. My house is on fire. I'll melt the dish. Taking a trick once in a while. My house is in flames. What will I do? What will I do? What will I do when you are Don't fire. you understand? My home is burning. Hey, 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 how can we play if you make so much noise? But he, my house He's is... right. What kind of a house you got? Stucco frame or brick? Brick. Brick. You got a lot of time. Brick takes longer than the boy. Sure. Please, hurry, hey, hurry. Just a minute. How big is your house? <laughs> Ten rooms and three baths. You got any mortgages on it? No, that's just... It, it's free and clear. Everything I have in the world, my life savings, play a jack. Can you imagine out of a blue sky comes a kibitzer? The nerve of some people to come here any time they like an ash to go to a fire. It's your fault. Why don't you keep the doors closed? Please hurry, please hurry. And go home and take some bicarbonate soda. Hurry, hurry. Just a minute. Did you throw any water on the fire? Of course I did, but it didn't do any good. What's the use of us going? That's all we do. Certainly. Oh, please, will you Say, hurry? Wait a, minute, wait a minute. How high is your house? Two stories? No, three stories. That's another story. No, please, hurry, hurry. Maybe I can help you. Oh, please, please. Oh, please. Is this a still alarm? Yes. Well, keep quiet, please. Chief, how many feet are story? Well, I should figure out, let me see, with Cuban feet, that's three foot to the feet, that's about 12 foot to the story. 12 foot to the story. Mm -hmm. That's three times 12. Yes. Three twos is uh, already put it, six. Put in a decimal right there, and that'll top the whole thing. Right? I'd better do it with Gazinta. Oh. That makes 36 feet. We only got a 12 foot hose, we can go. Oh, please, please, if you come this time, I'll never ask you again. Hey, Tess, just a minute. Here, come here. Yes, take this gasoline and go over and keep the home fire burning. We'll be right over. All right, all right, all right. Come all right, on, let's right. go. Right. That's my luck. Every time I get a good hand, somebody's got to come in and hollow fire. I never see Don't that. forget, you owe me for three games. That's all right, I'll give you my check. I don't want any checks, I want cash. What's the matter? Didn't you get my last check? I got it twice. Once from you and once from the bank. Look how that hat looks on you. What's the matter with the hat? It don't become you. Well, I like it. How does it look to go to a fire with a hat that don't look good on you? Say, listen, keep my hat out of your mouth, you hear? All right, people don't know if you're going to a fire or if you're coming back. If you keep on talking, I wouldn't oh, go to the fire. please help me. Please help me. What's the matter? Where's the fire, lady? There's no fire. No fire? You see, I live in a big house all alone, and I'm scared to death of burglars. 
Burglars, don't be scared. I'll send one of the boys over. Go over to the ladies' apartment and chase out the burglars. Listen, I'm afraid of myself. I should go chasing burglars. Go take a revolver and go over there to the ladies' house. I wouldn't carry a revolver. It's against the law. Against the law to carry a revolver. Against the bomb's law. I know a lot of people that keep revolvers under their pillows. And you want me to walk around all day with a pillar under my arm? You, you go over to downtown. I don't go. Now, uh, here's the key to my house. Now I'll go. You go feed the horses. What I want you to do. Is to sleep in my garage. And if you should hear any strange noises during the night, be sure and warn me so I can escape. Certainly I'll do that. Oh, I knew you would. You're so big and brave and handsome. Don't forget, I'll be waiting for you. Don't worry, lady. I'll be there ahead of you. Bye-bye. 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 Bye-bye, sponge cake. Well? As I'm a little lame, I'm gonna stop now. Hey, Chief, Chief, come here. Do you realize what you're doing? If a burglar comes in and finds you in the garage, he'll kill you. If he finds me in the garage, I deserve to be killed. This month, we're celebrating the phenomenon that changed history and TV forever. This is Robert Osborne inviting you to join me in saluting National Cable Month. It's not just television, it's an adventure. If you love movies, chances are you own a VCR. And if you own a VCR, what's a better, more convenient place to tape films than the Movie Channel's own VCR theater? We open the doors of our film library every night at 3 a.m., 2 a.m. Central, offering you a wide array of movies to record with no late charges and no penalty fees. Just some great films to tape while you sleep, then watch whenever you want. Beginning Friday, April 17th, travel to the deepest reaches of outer space with Explorers. On Saturday, take suspense and thrills from hard-hitting cop Charles Bronson in Murphy's Law. Sunday, April 19th, record comic madness when Albert Brooks and Julie Haggerty get lost in America. On Monday, unravel a grand murder caper with a cast of hilarious all-stars in Clue. Tuesday, April 21st, action and adventure for your tape library with Eric Stoltz in Codename Emerald. Wednesday, John Wayne's classic action-packed journey with Lauren Bacall, Blood Alley. Wrap up your week's recording on Thursday, April 23rd when Arnold Schwarzenegger leads a daring rescue mission in Commando. Now you can record these great movies when you sleep and watch them whenever you want on VCR Theater. Every night, 3 a.m., 2 a.m. Central. Now, the Movie Channel is the perfect VCR accessory. Coming soon on the Movie Channel. soon on the movie channel.